What's up, y'all? It's your girl, Katie, and welcome back to my channel. <laughs> Hello, everyone. I am back today. I think my last video I uploaded was actually in the car, but um, we're in the car again. Today, I am going to be trying out the new Starbucks fall drinks. <sighs> fall you guys just a wonderful time I have seen this video going around and I really 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 badly wanted to try the spring drinks when they came out like all of the new spring drinks and when I realized there was new drinks I was about two months late on the trend so we're here today to try to get this video up and to taste test these fall drinks before the whole world has completely tried them we're going to Starbucks we're gonna have a wonderful time. The line for this place is literally always down the street, which is an amazing time. So we're gonna wait in it. <laughs> like I do practically every morning. I will admit, I wait in this line. I've spent hours in this line. Yeah. All right, guys, so the line was... <laughs> Hold on. Sorry, Jake just invited me to the Asian supermarket and... <sighs> Anyways, I decided I'm going to go pick it up because this line was actually like I would have been here for maybe a couple days So I'm just gonna tell you what I'm getting the tall pumpkin spice frap the tall pumpkin spice latte Tall salted caramel mocha frap the tall pumpkin cream cold brew Which I've heard great things about and then I also want to try their new pumpkin like not not a cupcake It's like a it's like a muffin. Anyways, I'll be back. All right guys. Uh, I'm back and I'm back home because my camera went to act up all of a sudden when I started trying the drinks So I only managed to try a little sip of a pretty big sip of one of the drinks <laughs> But we're just gonna go for it. Anyways pick up Way faster. I'm just gonna take note of doing pick up every day now because I just that line is just it's just not well. Anyways, Stella also managed to get a hold of the whipped cream in one of them. <laughs> Sneaky little one. But I only tried this one, so we're just gonna act like I didn't try it and go for it again. <laughs> um, because my camera deleted the footage. This is the pumpkin cream cold brew. Now, this I've heard great things about. And then also when I was ordering this and I went up there, he was like, first of all, he was like, mm, you're feeling the pumpkin today? And I was like, yeah. But second of all, he was like, this one's really good. And I was like, I've heard good things, so let's try it out ourselves, you know? This one I heard was really strong, but honestly, I don't think it's that strong. I like the taste of coffee, so I wouldn't like, you know, say it's too overpowering. It's not like an espresso shot, but I will say if you don't like the taste of coffee, you're probably not gonna like this one just because it does have that strong taste of coffee, but I really like it. And I don't usually get cold brews, so I've never really had this, but it has, I guess, the pumpkin cream foam on top, which I'm gonna try by itself. Oh. Oh, yeah. You guys, if I could just get the pumpkin foam by itself, I would get a whole cup of it. So yeah, this one I guess is just a strong coffee and I also heard that it's like literally liquid crack or like the biggest energy boost you'll ever have. So, I mean, after four of these, I'm gonna be set. And then I also wanted to get the pumpkin muffin, but they didn't have it. They were sold out. So I got the pumpkin loaf loaf cake. Final version on this, I think it's good. I can already feel the jitters, but despite that, I love it. I have two fraps and then one hot drink. I think I'm gonna go for a frap first. Maybe this one that Stella decided to take a little dip in. <laughs> um, This is the mocha frap, salted caramel mocha frap. I feel like I've heard of this one before, so I don't know if it's new, but it was on the feature, so we're gonna give it a go. I haven't had a frap since my last Starbucks trying drink, but besides that, like since sixth grade, it's been so long. Oh my god. Oh god. Okay. The flavors. The flavors are immaculate. I mean, you can really taste the like salted caramel feel. You can taste the chocolate and the mocha. And I don't even want to know how much sugar is in that just because right off the back it's like 
I'm eating a chocolate bar, but this is something I would so treat myself with. I can see why people like to get these, like, if you don't really like the coffee taste, because it's not that strong. It's more like lots of sugar, but... Oh! Now I need to compare fraps because that one was definitely in the lead of the drinks right now. The next one is the pumpkin frap which I don't think I've ever tried. So here we go, here we go. It seems like we got a little whipped cream, maybe like nutmeg. I don't know, we'll give it a go. Ooh, <laughs> I don't even know what to say. This one literally tastes like I'm eating a pumpkin, pumpkin bread. It tastes just like pumpkin bread. You can't taste, is there coffee in this one? I don't know if there is you can't taste it I guarantee you guys this one you can just taste the mocha so if you've had like a mocha then it kind of tastes similar to that just blended with ice but the salted caramel flavor in this one is popping and I love it like this is still I think my favorite over this one but I'm not gonna be well after this video quick intermission um this is the pumpkin loaf cake i don't think this is new either so much for the trying new things video but i wanted to get a sweet treat to go with the coffee and they were out of the cream cheese muffin which looked so good so i ended up getting this but i've never had it mm. oh my god This is so good. Is it bread? Or is it a cake? No, but it doesn't taste like bread. It tastes like a cake. I'm really digging it. And then you get this to wash it down, you know? We've tried three out of the four drinks, and I feel like I'm going through this video extremely fast. But last drink we have is a hot drink. I never order hot drinks unless I'm like sick and I'm shivering to the high heavens and I just really feel like a nice hot drink. I never order hot drinks. I don't know, I never finish them and then they get cold and then they're nasty. Ice drinks are the way to go. It can literally be 10 degrees out and I will go and order an iced drink. Shout out middle school Katie for always getting frappes in the morning in the winter time. I don't know what I was thinking on that end, but like just a nice iced coffee. I don't know, it just, and then I finish them in the matter of two seconds, so you don't really have to worry about the ice melting, you know? Anyways, I'm getting carried away. Let's go for this hot drink. This is the pumpkin latte. Now, I'm sure you can get this iced, and I was going to get this iced, but I was like, since I already have three cold drinks, we gotta switch it up. So, tall pumpkin latte. Mmm, okay. You can taste slight pumpkin. You can taste slight sweetness. But what I have to say about the hot drinks, there's only been a few hot drinks I've tried in my day in these type of videos that has been like wow worthy. This one I have to say feels like it blends in with the rest of the hot drinks. I don't know. I just feel like whenever I have tried a hot drink or a hot coffee, they all taste the same. Is that for anybody else? Because when I try all of these different combinations of iced coffee, which I post on my story all the time, when I try them, like they each have their own distinct individual flavors. And then the hot ones, I don't know, it just blends together. Maybe because it's hot, maybe because... I have no idea. It's good though. It is good and if you like a hot coffee, I have to say it does have a small tinge of pumpkin flavor. You know, it's not bad. I'm just more of an iced coffee kind of girl. These ones, you can clearly taste that they're different, but I feel like if I were to get like a mocha coffee and try it that, that was hot, it would taste similar to that one. I don't know, it's just not, it's not really striking to me. This though, this pumpkin flavor in here is just fireworks. But this one, it, it takes the lead, you guys. I have to say, it takes the lead. You know, I really enjoy trying these new drinks. I think it's really fun. And yes, I did just consume almost two Frappuccinos and very close to a whole cold brew. It's kicking in. Um, and I'd also like to mention I didn't eat breakfast, so. <laughs> Pray for me. Anyways, you guys, there we have it. This is 10 out of 10 right here. If you guys have tried these, comment down below. Let me know what you think. Let me know what you think about my hot drink theory and how you feel about cold brews. How do you feel about fraps? Are you a frap girl? What kind of 
what kind of coffee do you like to order? Anything coffee or Starbucks related, go ahead and comment it down below. That concludes me trying Starbucks new fall drinks. I really, really like, I like them all. Okay, I like them all. I was just saying the hot one tastes very similar to things I've had in the past, whereas these three taste very unique and delicious. So I really hope you guys enjoyed this video. And if you did, please smash that thumbs up button and subscribe down below. And don't forget to press that notification bell to get notified every time I upload and to become part of the notification squad, hashtag Rose Gang. So that is all for today. I'm going to go jump on my bed for 15 minutes. Um, <laughs> and I will see you guys in my next one. Bye. Yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. Ay, coming in, coming in, yeah. Flex, I just wanna win, yeah. LABB, who we running with, yeah. Two, two, three, three, I'm on ten again.